Hello guys, thought I'd just make a quick update video. Uh, this last week I've had three malts, all from three trenches that were actually in enclosures, all next to each other on there. Right, I've uh, right, my, I think this is actually a Nandu Chromatis Juvenile, was malted. Just down there, but I won't be able to find out if he's definitely an Androchromatis until he actually leaves that hide, or the burrow, shall I say. Uh, next one is my juvenile Pocalosteria fasciata, which he's put last the chromatis and the fasciata have both been rehoused recently but I think the fasciata will need a new enclosure now it's just there so it's quite big and I'm pretty sure that's metal but none of these malts have been able to actually uh, well the abdomen's destroyed abdomen's destroyed and this one which is my juvenile OBT which is really messed up, so I won't be able to find that at all. But it's just, just so you can see the legs poking out. So, yeah, I've had uh, three malts this week. I had a malt last week. I do like to sort of keep them up as best I can. I've got three there. I've got my subadult regalis, my subadult uh, burgundy goliath bird eater, theraphosostermi, my lassiodora parahibana, a couple of, well, a few slings. Yeah, and um, because of the Regalis malt, I decided to uh, switch the Regalis and the Metallica enclosures. I gave her a hide, but at the moment she is, if I can get the camera around there, she's just there, hiding behind that. Yeah, due to her size, I thought she better have the larger enclosure. And my Pocalotheria Metallica. So I have the small one, and it's actually using the hide. Let's see if I can get a good recording of it. There we go. I'm not sure if that's a sub adult male or female yet. It was sold to me as a male, but. Won't know for sure until uh, it molts. I have had one loss uh, for my trenches. Uh, my avicularia versicolor spiderling uh, was doing fine one night. It's, it had eaten, then woke up the next morning and it it just done the death curl. That's it. Thought I'd have a bit of a switch around. So I set up, I'm going to get some more racking, make it a bit better so I can fit larger enclosure and stuff because my Therapose Sturmy in this enclosure will need a, you can just see the legs in the abdomen there, will need a bigger enclosure. Uh, you can't see that one, but. Yep, so, um. Other than the one death that I've had, it's been a pretty good week. So, hope you enjoy this video. Thank you and goodbye.